All right, so from hands-on cooking to gardening, the Olive Wood Garden provides a space for little kids, for young kids to learn about food and yep. eating healthy. Here's a look now at the nearly seven-acre garden. Check it out. Tucked away on a quiet street in National City is a beautiful yellow house lined with a porch and nestled to its side, a luscious big backyard. But if you look closer, you will see a place that is changing the health of young kids all around the city and county. Olivewood is a garden and nutrition education center for kids and families, and we bring people from the community into the gardens, and we teach them about where their food comes from, and we connect them with the natural environment. The house was built in 1896, and there's been three families that have lived in the house. The last family that lived here, when they moved out, they donated the whole property. And one of the stipulations in their donation was that the gardens that they had built would continue to be maintained and would be leveraged for the community benefit. So Olivewood Gardens was born. Now hundreds of third, fourth, and fifth graders make special trips to the gardens to learn about healthy choices. Are these your two? Yeah. Oh, no. The most amazing thing about Olivewood is seeing that spark that happens when a child or an adult connects with where their food comes from. Well, I think this is a cool place because like maybe you could come here to learn about plants and like get healthy food. Kids don't want vegetables because they think they, they taste is bad, but when they get to, if they come over here, they're gonna change their minds. They see it, they touch it, they learn about it. When they see celery growing out of the ground and they recognize it and they say, Oh my gosh, I never knew that's how celery grew. Or when they look at broccoli for the first time and they say, wow, look at the size of those leaves. I had no idea. And it's just, it's so magical to see how food comes to life for them. And the magic doesn't stop there. The kids then take their food to the kitchen and learn how to cook. Rotate, pinch, rotate, pinch, rotate, pinch. When they go into the kitchen and they prepare meals and they chop and they cut and they tear the herbs apart and they make something themselves and they're so proud of it. Do you think you got all of the ingredients on there? If we can change the way we're eating, we can change our longevity, we can change our health, we can impact health outcomes. Family by family, community by community, we're really impacting health outcomes here in National City and throughout the county. And even though veggies may still not be a kid's first choice of food, at least they are learning a golden rule. Take one big bite before saying no thank you.